Well, each week we're joined by Hope Rises to share heartwarming stories. This week we have such a special story. Um, Kate Glazer is here from Hope Rises in the middle of the couch here. Lydia Dominic, the founder of Buffalo Gives, and then Kilby, the owner of Half and Half. We'll start with Lydia first. Lydia, you went over to Poland and you brought a ton of supplies with you, including bulletproof vests. Um, and you're also going back to Poland as well. But explain why bulletproof vests? Why was that a need over there? Um, yeah, so it's not readily available. There are people that are fighting that don't have that, and it's so important. And when I got there, I, I, I met these families. I know these families. Um, so I know these little kids who have dads and brothers that are fighting um, in T-shirts. So it became my personal mission to make sure that we could equip them to be able to see their, their brothers and their wives again. Obviously an emotional thing to even yeah, just talk about. It is. This is probably in a very emotional situation going over there and seeing it firsthand. I mean, yeah. everyone gets emotional watching it on TV, but being there. And you're doing so much good. Buffalonians are doing so much good helping you yeah. do this. Um, we're going to move it to Kate now. Kate, you have a special surprise for Lydia. As I mentioned, Lydia is heading back to she Poland is. to help more refugees mm -hmm. and more people in Ukraine who are currently fighting. It's just amazing to see what Lydia has been able to do. I actually went to her store and saw all the supplies that she was able to collect and just knowing it's going into the right hands. And she is truly a hope hero in our Western New York community. Uh -huh. So we thought, how can we help her? And yeah. we knew that Kilby had wanted to um, support a Hope Rises initiative, especially one that is going to Ukraine. I won't steal her thunder because <laughs> she has a great announcement for Lydia just to be able to support all of her efforts in Ukraine and everything we can do in Western New York to support those thousands of miles away. So Kilby, why don't yes. you tell him? Yes, yes. But like you said, this is very emotional. So I'm tearing up a little bit just telling you. But um, Half and Half is so excited to partner with um, both of you guys, and we'll be donating 5% of our sales from now until the end of April right back to you so you can buy those bulletproof vests and help those families in need. And then on top of that, for every um, amount of money we raise, my mom and I are going to match it to give it right back to you. <laughs> um, we want to do something, and you're, what you're doing is just so incredible and so impactful and powerful. So we're really, really happy about that. Additionally, we're going to be collecting um, medicine for children from now until the end of April. So anyone who comes in and donates any kind of medicine for children, they'll get 20% off their purchase. And that'll, again, go right back to you so you can bring that over to Poland. And we're going to start it off with a, our first donation here, <laughs> medication. It's all in this bag. So Hope Rises bought some medication. We'll buy more. So Kilby, you can take this back. But Excellent. anyone that goes to Half and Half can either make a donation or they can yep. make a donation of, of medical supplies, all going to your efforts. And truly, we are so honored to do this, Lydia, because you are literally going there. You are the boots on the ground for Western New York. And we are so privileged to do this for you. I, I can't believe how much my community has already given and then people like you <laughs> step in and blow me away. Thank you so much. No, um, anytime I hear that, uh, that anyone wants to give and, and in such a consistent way, we're going to continue to need that. So thank you so much. And I think of what one vest can do and what one vest can protect one man, but then how many people can he protect? Mm -hmm. So thank you. That's amazing. Absolutely. I appreciate you. I know you were saying medicine. I know this is so I emotional. Uh, medicine is mm -hmm very yeah. highly needed as well. Mm -hmm. So the drop off is huge mm -hmm. that Kilby yep. is now offering. Tell me about why you're going back to Poland really quickly. Um, we've been able to really streamline exactly what we need. Um, now I'm able to ship vests and ballistic helmets, but um, I need to bring medication with me. So yeah. um, cold meds and pill form, um, all forms of children's medication and medical supplies are still needed, specifically things to stop bleeding and help with burns. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well, thank you for what you've done, Kilby. Thank you for this. I feel like I'm not even a hugger, but I feel like we all need yeah. like, a little yeah. bit of a hug right now on this yeah. couch. This is what it's all about. There's a lot going yes. on here. Um, we'll, of course, post mo more information on how you can give, how you can find Half and Half, and then how you can find um, Buffalo Gives, too, to give as she heads back to Poland to help these refugees who need so much, who have lost literally everything. All right, we appreciate it, ladies. We'll be right back. Mike is tracking that forecast when we come back.